Let's denote the sum of the given series by Sn. Now note that the general term of the series is equal to n minus in brackets k minus 1 multiplied by x raised to the power k minus 1 where k varies from 1 to n. Therefore, Sn can be expressed as summation k going from 1 to n n minus k plus 1 times x raised to the power k minus 1. This can be written as summation k is equal to 1 to n n plus 1 times x raised to the power k minus 1 minus k times x raised to the power k minus 1. This can be broken into two components. The first component is n plus 1 times summation x raised to the power k minus 1 and the second component is minus summation k times x raised to the power k minus 1. Now note that summation k going from 1 to n x raised to the power k minus 1 is equal to 1 plus x plus x square plus and so on n terms and this is a geometric series which adds up to 1 minus x raised to the power n upon 1 minus x. Now note that summation k times x raised to the power k minus 1 is equal to the derivative with respect to x of summation x raised to the power k which is equal to the derivative with respect to x of x plus x square plus x cube plus and so on till x raised to the power n. Now notice that the expression inside the brackets is a geometric series which adds up to x times in brackets 1 minus x raised to the power n upon 1 minus x and therefore this summation is equal to the derivative with respect to x of x minus x raised to the power n plus 1 upon 1 minus x. This is equal to 1 minus x times the derivative of the numerator which is 1 minus n plus 1 times x raised to the power n minus the numerator times the derivative of the denominator which is minus 1 divided by 1 minus x whole square. Therefore, Sn is equal to n plus 1 times 1 minus x raised to the power n upon 1 minus x minus 1 minus x times in brackets 1 minus n plus 1 times x raised to the power n plus x minus x raised to the power n plus 1 upon 1 minus x whole square. This is equal to 1 upon 1 minus x whole square times in brackets n plus 1 times 1 minus x times 1 minus x raised to the power n minus 1 minus x times in brackets 1 minus n plus 1 times x raised to the power n minus x plus x raised to the power n plus 1. Opening up the expression in the brackets, we get 1 upon 1 minus x whole square multiplied by in brackets n plus 1 minus n plus 1 times x raised to the power n minus n plus 1 times x plus n plus 1 times x raised to the power n plus 1 minus, in brackets, 1 minus n plus 1 times x raised to the power n minus x plus n plus 1 times x raised to the power n plus 1 minus x plus x raised to the power n plus 1. Notice that n plus 1 times x raised to the power n cancels. So does n plus 1 times x raised to the power n plus 1. And this whole expression simplifies to 1 upon 1 minus x whole square times in brackets n minus nx minus x plus x raised to the power n plus 1. And this can be rearranged as 1 upon 1 minus x whole square times in brackets 
n times 1 minus x plus x times in brackets x raised power n minus 1. And therefore, Sn is equal to n upon 1 minus x plus x times in brackets x raised to the power n minus 1 upon 1 minus x whole square. And this is the required answer.